Charles has a premiere that looks like the Count out of Sesame Street. Ah, ah, ah! Vote for me! Ah, ah, ah! And congratulations to Bob Hawke, too. As a comedian, I thank him for writing Australia's funniest ever book, The Hawke Memoirs. Anyone read this book? Yeah, it's about how many you sold, too. A hilarious book where Bob tells us about how he ended apartheid in South Africa, how uh, he won the America's Cup, how he pushed Australia into Asia, how Bob built the pyramids 2,000 years ago, and about how under the leadership of Bob Hawke, Australia single-handedly won the Gulf War. Oh, yes, Bob didn't muck around during the Gulf War, did he, eh? Bugger it, he said. Send three ships over there. <laughs> Big ships, too. None of that inflatable shit. <laughs> that Saddam Hussein was up there in Baghdad shooting himself. Now, we made a big contribution to the Gulf War, but it was secret. We sent over a specially trained force of Aussie fighting men that are feared throughout the world. Forget about the Marines or the Gurkhas or the SAS or the Red Beret. Pansies! When the real battle hotted up, they sent the Aussies in. The elite of the Australian Armed Forces. The Yobbers! <laughs> ah! Fully equipped in their fighting thongs. <laughs> Stubbies, blue singlets and terry toweling hats. <laughs> and then they drop in ten truckloads of piss. <laughs> what a deadly combination. As they chase the Iraqis through the sand, rack off! <laughs> you shout! <laughs> With their sacred motto, suck more peace. <laughs> and then the real elite of the Yobbos, the guys with the shorts pulled down, go in. The crack troops. <laughs> ah, yes.